Hi, Mark with PJ Advanced Hair Teaching Professional here, and today I'd like to help you with the trajectory of your little pitches and, and your wedge shots in general. Had an email in from a, from a chap, and he, he was saying in his email, he always tends to hit his little pitches and his wedge shots high. There's no control into the wind, you know, if he's got a, a pitch shot into the wind, the ball will just climb up into the wind and it'll stall and it'll come down, it'll be, you know, quite short of the target. Sometimes it doesn't even get to, to the front edge of the green. Now the thing that you've got to understand to, to start with is it's going to be the loft of the club that's going to start to control the loft of your pitches and, and your wedge shots and also the angle of attack. You know, if you get too shallow on the angle of attack, again that can start to pop the ball up in the air. So you need to start to make sure that the angle of attack is a little bit more steeper as you come down. So let's just talk about the setup first off and then we'll talk about the, the swing um, angle of attack and things in a second. Now, for me to hit, this, I, can, I can hit three low shots, okay? Now, my first low shot, which is the lowest wedge, which is going to be one that takes a couple of bounces on the green and then it spins like anything, so it just grabs the green and almost comes to a sudden halt. Now, this one is where I have the ball right of centre in my stance, I have 60% of the weight on my left side and I have the top of the grip in line with my left thigh and my spine's leaning towards the target. Now throughout the swing I'm going to kind of hold that setup profile so I'm not going to lean back as I come down. I'm going to swing back and I'm going to really hold the finish through here so at no point am I letting the club flip back up. I'm always going to be holding the loft off the club so as I come down to strike it I'm holding the loft off as I go through. Now my angle of attack is going to be a steep angle of attack because there's a steep angle of attack, launches the ball naturally lower anyway. So that, that's going to give me a real high spinning, very low pitch or wedge shot if you like. So I'll go ahead and play one for you. So we just get set into that setup position, ball back, 60% of the weight on the left side, top of the grip in line with the left thigh, spine towards the target, hold the loft off, steep angle of attack and I've really held the finish off there as well. So that, that will go in very low. Now if I wanted to send one in a little bit higher, I'm going to have the ball in the middle of the stance, 60% of the weight on the left side, top of the grip in line with the thigh, spine leaning towards the target, and again, I'm going to really hold the finish off, okay? So let's go ahead and play that one. So that one will fly a little bit higher. Again, it's going to go in with the same amount of spin control as well. So the higher one is going to be ball forward of centre in the stance, 60% of the weight on the left side, top of the grip in line with the thigh, spine leaning towards the target, and again, I'm going to really hold the finish off as I go through. So all of these are with a steep angle of attack. So that is how you control your low trajectory pitch shots, wedge shots. That, that's really going to create three nice different trajectories that you can play around with. So try, you know, go out there and hit the lowest one, then hit one a little bit higher, then the one a little bit higher, and it, you know, keep doing it, keep practicing it, and, and over a period of time you'll start to really get the feel of it, and like I say, the ball will go into that green, a couple of bounces, and spin, just like the pros do on tour. Hope you enjoyed this one.